10. Bill Rizzuto throwing out the first pitch. 9. Fastball hit deep to right. It's looking in. Way back there. Oh! Eight. 8. Lauren Peter Barra, known to everyone as Yogi, star catcher of the New York Yankees. 7. Here's the payoff pitch. This is it. There it goes. It's out of here. This ball club will be remembered by me forever because you have heart as big as this city and you showed what being New Yorkers is all about. God bless you. Five. Pitch in 56 consecutive games. That's an all-time record set by the Yankee Clipper Joe DiMaggio. Four. Four. Today, Today, I consider myself myself the luckiest man man on the face of the earth. Please. Number three will never be worn by another Yankee player, but will go to America's baseball shrine at Cooperstown, New York. Two. Garrett Jeter ends his final game with a walk-off single. Garrett Jeter, where fantasy becomes reality. One. One. That's not the way it's going to be, George. You're right, it is. If you don't like it, you're fired. You haven't hired me yet. Yeah, what is going on, everybody? It is I, yours truly, the Ace. Haven't seen you guys in a long time. It's been a whole five minutes, five, ten minutes I've seen you guys. Thank you all for popping into the uh, uh, members giveaway. Appreciate you guys, but it feels so good to be back. Like I said, it is I, yours truly, the Ace. Check on the rep. Yep, second and none. Thank you all for popping in as we are game two of this three-game set where the New York Yankees are taking on the Arizona Diamondbacks. Yankees were able to get a W yesterday. Appreciate everybody for popping in. Brandon is in the building. Thank you for dropping the Ace Avenue emoji. Thank you, Dr. Vaughn. Thank you for dropping the Yankee emoji. My guy, Max Covered, saying she uh, dropping those Dominguez emojis. Appreciate that. Big Blue Wrecking Crew was in the building, says, let's go. Antonio, my guy, says, let's go, Ace. You are the best announced for the Yankees. Let's go. Six in a row. Let's go. That's right, baby. That's right. Yankees are trying for six in a row as first 6 no start probably in a long time. I got to look at the exact stats. But it's been a while since the Yankees had a team like this. It just feels a lot different. And that's with the infusion of Juan Soto. Juan Soto is paying dividends all up and down this lineup. Guys are playing better. And you know what? It feels so good to be a Yankee fan right about now. Uh, Jacob's in the building. What up, Ace? What up, chat? What's going on? Super Miguel Plush, thank you for popping in. Says it's the number, uh, it's the one in the Yankees retired number supposed to be Thurman Munson. Uh, no. But thank you guys for popping in. No, Billy Martin is number one. Thurman Munson was I gotta see what his I don't remember what his number was. No, he was number 15. Number 15. I just looked it up. No, Billy Martin, number one. But no, he does have his number retired as well at number 15. Um, but the Yankees are taking on the Arizona Diamondbacks. Let's see, make sure everything is good to go. Got the music on. Game two is about to be underway. Yankees looking for their second series win in a row. The lineups for our New York Yankees. Favorite tour is at second. Soto on right, Judge in center, Rizzo at first, Stanton, DH, and Verdugo in left, Volpe at short. Volpe had himself a great game yesterday. First four-hit game of his career. Then Trevino behind up, uh, and Trevino is behind the plate in ninth. And in the A spot, we have Oswaldo Cabrera, who has gotten off to a good start this season. Nestor Cortez is on the bump. Struggled in his first two innings in his first outing. And then settled down, looking for a little bit of a quicker start for this start. 
And the Arizona and the Arizona Diamondbacks combat that with Gallon, who's on the mound, their ace. Um, Marte, second base, Alexander DH and Goriao left field. Walker at first, Suarez at third, Moreno behind the plate. Uh Barosa, who came in late in yesterday's game in center field, McCarthy in right and Perdomo at short. Andre's in the building. Tough, uh, tough matchup for Nasty Nestor. Yeah, we're gonna see if he could uh get a better second start. Just making sure we got everything good to go for the stream. Another late night edition of the Ace Avenue here, ladies and gentlemen. And I do appreciate you guys for popping in. Tomorrow's stream is at um is at 3:40. I will be on Grunt Baseball's channel tomorrow, calling that game. So you guys know I'll drop the link in the community tab. So make sure. You guys pop over there and hang out with yours truly. We're on the road to 1K still, ladies and gentlemen. Five subs from 950. Hit that like button on the way in. If you're new to the channel, hit that sub. We get to 30 likes, 20 away, and I'll give away some memberships for next month's giveaway. Congratulations to my guy, Adrian. I gotta send him, I gotta send him the link real quick to the uh to the site. But congratulations to my guy Adrian on um winning this month's giveaway, being a member, also a mod on the channel. I really appreciate him and all his support. Let me see, hold on. Um Rocket Cheer Cowboy, what up, Ace? Can we go 6-0? and I don't see why we can't. We're going to need a better start from Nesta Cortez, though, to be honest with you. When I'm ready for tonight's game, 13 people in the building total. If you guys haven't done so, hit that like. New to the channel, hit that subscribe. All right, Meredith is on the mic right now. You know the Yankees are about to get started here shortly. James Brosen, first season as Yankees hitting coach. All right, but let's go. Let's see. Uh, let's see what some of the other scores around the league are, real quick, because I am paying attention to a couple of others. Uh, bottom of the eighth inning. Still, I thought the. Uh... Oh no, game day is a little bit okay. Bottom of the eighth inning. White Sox are up on the. Uh... White Sox are up right now on the uh, on the Braves. I definitely picked the Braves to win. And of course, now that I pick them, they want to lose. Chicago kicked the shit out of uh, Cleve, uh, Colorado, ten to nothing. Houston's up one to nothing after throwing a no hitter yesterday. No score in Oakland right now. Uh, Milwaukee beat the Twins three to one. Baltimore lost to Kansas City four to one. Sitting at three and two. So the Yankees still in first place, ladies and gentlemen. All 
All right, game is about to get started, ladies and gentlemen. Who's getting that first New York Yankee hit? Put it down in the comment section. Who's going to get that first Yankee hit today, ladies and gents? Terry, thanks for popping in. Hey, Ace, let's go Yankees. Zach Gillen, Thursday versus the Rockies, five innings, three hits, one run. Three Ks. Glaber Torres is in the box. Let's go. Terry says judge. Okay. I'm going to say Soto gets that first hit. Super Miguel Plush says Soto will get the first hit. Okay, as Gleyber Torres takes that low for a ball. One ball, no strikes. Terry, thank you for rocking with me as always. Like, you know, I know you're up late. You always got the uh, the late night. You always had the late night nursing, nursing shift. So I know you're up this late. Two balls, no strike count to Gleyber Torres. But hit that like, guys. New to the channel, hit that sub. Ball outside. Three balls, no strike count. Yankees in search of their first runner of the game with their first batter. 3-0 count. Incoming. Here's the pitch to Glaber. Taking all the way. That looked like it should have been ball four, but he gets the call on that one. Made more money a night shift. Yeah, I know, I know how that is. Rocking chair, thanks for popping in. Says he's calling Judge to break out tonight. Okay. Daniel Berry Sports Highlight. Thank you for popping in. Says, what's up, everyone? Here's the 3-1 to Glaber Torres. Called strike in the outside corner. That one looked like it was a little bit closer to a strike. Still a little bit outside, though. 3-2 count. Yankees have been having a lot of full counts to start this season off. Here's the payoff pitch. And he walked them. So the leadoff man is on to start this inning for one Soto, ladies and gentlemen, if you're a member of the channel, drop those Soto emojis in the chat for our guy, Juan Soto. Also, if you're not a member, become a member. We just did a giveaway. My guy, Adrian, just won some Ace Avenue merchandise. Best $2.99 you will ever spend. I promise you, ladies and gentlemen. Terry says, good eye, Glaber. That's Yes, it was. First pitch to Soto, ball inside, 1-0. Antonio was in the building against his first hit, Soto or Judge. Yeah, I got Soto getting the first hit. Let's get a little home run here. I will be live tomorrow on Grunt's channel, 340 start time. I'll drop the link in the community tab. So make sure you guys pop over there. Two balls, no strike count to the two-hole hitter, Soto. And then the Yankees are off Thursday. And then I will be live right here on the Ace Avenue for the Yankee home opener at 1 o'clock. Really excited for that one. You just know that Soto's hitting a home run his first Yankee, uh, his first game in Yankee Stadium. The 2 1, runner on first, nobody out. The pitch is a called strike in the outside corner. Inside corner, should say 2 1. Um, J uh, Jacob says, or you can get the membership for free if you get one gifted. Yeah, but it's random. Or you could just support whatever you want to do. You want to get a free membership? Get that like button up. We get to 30 and I'll gift away a membership. Here's the 2-1 to Soto. Fouls that one. 2-2. Two, two. Best way to support the channel and it's free. Cost you guys nothing. We did have a lot of members this month. 58 members total. Two-two count to Soto. Here's the pitch. Hit on the ground. Right to the first baseman. That might be two. Throws a second for one and gets the double play. So just like that, we have two outs here in the top of the first inning. Here's Aaron Judge. Drop those all rise emojis in the chat for the captain, Aaron Judge. Double plays have been a problem for us. In these first five games, we've been hitting into a lot of double plays. Inning killers right there. Oh, it's all good, Terry. Appreciate you, though. Appreciate you for trying. Uh, ball low. One ball, no strikes. All rise in the building. It says, what's up, Ace? Good to see you back. Good to see you, all rise. Appreciate you for popping in. This was all rise first time as a member for the uh for the giveaway. Ball low, 2-0. -oh. 
But hit that like, ladies and gentlemen. Hit that sub. You're new. Six subs from 950. Val says, I got Volpe for the first home run. Okay. The 2-0. Ball low. 3-0. Yankees still in search of their first hit, Val. Who's getting that first Yankee hit today? Rizzo on deck. And he's going to be up as Judge walks. So a two-out walk puts the captain on. Two away here for Anthony Rizzo. They did not give him the green light there. Too low. The ball was too low. Gallon's a pretty de Gallon's a pretty good pitcher. Yankees are gonna have to make sure make him work tonight. We got into the bullpen pretty early yesterday, so it'd be nice to do it again today. Ball low to Rizzo. One ball, no strike count. Two walks in the inning for the Yankees, but a double play wiped off the leadoff uh, walk, and we got an early mound visit right now. Huh, this is a this is a uh, little bit of an early mound visit. Wonder if he's okay. What I think of IKF on the mound yesterday, he's one of the best pitchers in the league. I mean, come on. Why wouldn't you put him out there? Judge on first, Gallon at 17 pitches. Don't know what that mound visit is really about. Maybe just checking to see if he's okay. The 1-0 incoming. Hit on the ground right to the second baseman who's positioned perfectly. Throws the first for out number three. So that'll retire the side in the first inning. We are heading to the bottom of the first. Nestor Cortez coming on the bump. He'll face Marte, Alexander, and Gurriel. Looking for a much better start for Nestor Cortez than he did last time. Last time out, he was able to settle down against a really good Astros team. Got hit around in the first couple in the first two couple innings and then settled down his last three. Uh the big baby is on Max Channel trashing Judge right now. Uh who are you referring to? I think I know who you're talking about. You don't have to say it. I'll pop over there and see. Oh, uh, yeah. I think I know who you're talking about. Yeah, Terry, you really don't like that kid, huh? <laughs> All right, the lineback, uh, the line, lineback, the Diamondbacks lineup. Marte, Alexander, Goria, Walker, Suarez, uh, Moreno, Barosa, McCarthy, and Perdomo. Uh, Val says he needs to beat Nasty tonight. Yep, that he does. That he does. Nesta Cortez, last outing, five innings, five hits, four runs. Five strikeouts. We need him to be a lot better today. All right. First pitch from Nasty Nestor. Catches the outside corner. 0-1. Oh, for real? That's fucked up. That's messed. I know he's a mod over there. That's messed up. Are you still blocked? Rip foul. 0-2. That's why it's like you really got to watch who's uh who your mods are. For real, for real. Here's the 0-2. Rip to left, and that's going to be a base hit as that gets to the wall. That might be extra bases. Marte rounding first 
And he'll be on with a leadoff double to start this inning. Nesta Cortez already in a little bit of a jam. Runner on second. Nobody out. Defense for the Yankees. Verdugo going left. Judge center. Soto right. Rizzo first. Torres second. Volpe at short. Cabrera at third. And Trevino behind the plate. All right, here's Alexander. First pitch to him is a ball inside. One ball, no strikes. Why Trevino? Eh, Austin Wells played a couple of Austin Wells played a couple of games in a row. Give him a little bit of a break. Alley Cat is in the building. That's popped up and out of play. Alley Cat says the Yankees are so back. Yep, we like it. We love it. Appreciate you for popping in, Alley Cat. The 1-1, one, one, runner on second. The pitch, ball inside. Two balls, no strikes. Yeah, I expect Austin Wells to call the game tomorrow, to catch the game tomorrow. Here's the 2-1. Hit on the ground, and that's going to get past Volpe. That's going to score the first run of the game. Yankees down, one nothing before Nestor can even uh, call it out. Am I covering the game tomorrow? I will, Alley Cat, but I'll be calling it on my partner's channel, Grunt Baseball channel. I call about six games a week here, and then because I'm trying to help him get the live on his, I'll call it on his tomorrow, but I'll be back on my channel on Friday. But I will drop the link in my community tab. I call pretty much all the Yankee games. Goreal. First pitch, hits that in the air. Soto's there. He's under it. He'll make the catch for out number one. One away. But make sure you hit that like and subscribe. Make sure you uh, have the notification bell on. So anytime I drop something, you'll know. I'll have I'll be on Grunt's channel. I usually drop the link there. I'm on his channel every Wednesday. But every other day, I'm over here on the Ace Avenue. I am yours truly, the Ace. Here's Christian Walker. Here's the pitch called striking the inside corner. Oh, one. So Alley Cat, I always like to ask to new subscribers, how'd you find the Ace Avenue? Always want to know so that way I can go ahead and uh, promote the channel better. Oh, I try, Terry. I try. I appreciate you. And I appreciate you for uh, for supporting both channels. Ball high, 1-1. One, one. Uh, I might, I'm gonna, probably going to be on my own to cover the draft, but this is the thing. It just depends on if I can get somebody to cover it with me. If I can find somebody to do it with me, I'll do it. If not, it's hard to do by yourself. Um, Ball. I mean, no, um, we have a 1-1 one, one count. Jay is in the building. So let's go Yankees. Sorry, I got distracted. Um, If I can find somebody to do it with me, I'll do it. Here's the 1-1. One, one. The pitch. Runner takes off, ball high, throws, and he's safe. Runner in scoring position, Alexander with the steal. Runner on second, one away. Oh, I appreciate that, uh, Ali. Trying to find uh, someone covering the game since your yes account got hacked. That sucks. Hopefully you get more, hopefully you get that access back. And I appreciate you for popping on, and thank you even more for subscribing. What keyword did you search? I'm curious. 2-1 count. Nesta Cortez struggling a little bit in this first inning. Ball high, 3-1. Come on, Nesta. Terry says, come on, Glaber. That was a bad throw by, uh, by Trevino. Three one count here. Hit on the ground, right past the diving Volpe. They're going to hold up the runner on third. So runners on first and, and third. One out. Runners on the corners. Nesta Cortez struggling again. Live Yankee coverage. Okay, appreciate you. I'll, I'll make sure to promote that uh, more, more too to get more people over here.
Uh, I think Max usually hangs out with his friends on the draft. I don't know. You'd have to ask him. A couple of times I asked him, I think he might be hanging out with his friends. I'm not I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I don't want to speak for him. I'm not sure. All right, runners on the corners for the five-hole hitter Suarez. Tomcat, thank you for popping in. Ball inside. One ball, no strikes. Nestor got to lose some weight carrying the extra weight catches up. Nestor just doesn't... He has to be called strike in the inside corner. Nestor has to be a very finesse type pitcher because he doesn't have like... Like, for example, his fastball was 91 just now. Just hit 91. So you have to be able to pitch pitch in order to get through these games. The 1-1 from Cortez. Ball high. Runner takes off the throw, and he is safe. Second stolen base of the inning. Nestor Cortez, a little bit slow to the to, to the plate. Dre's in the building says Nestor is buns. I mean, look. I, I he's looking shaky. We'll see if he can rebound as that's hitting the air, and that's gonna score a run. Judge throws it in. Yankees down 2 0. Another shaky start for Nestor Cortez. Look, he settled down last time. See if he could do it again. But let's get that like button up, guys. 12 likes away from 30. We get to 30, and I'll gift away another membership. Still one out, meeting on the mound. Let me tell you, I did say in the beginning of the year, if there was a man that was going to be the odd man out, someone asked me. I don't. I didn't think it was going to be Clark Schmidt. I did say I think it would be Nestor Cortez. So the first two innings of each start, he's got hit around. Here's Moreno. Two on, one out. They're looking like strong contenders to return to the World Series. Call a strike in the outside corner. They're a good team. They're not a power-hitting team, but they're a really good baseball team. Stealing bases, going from first to third, small ball. They're really good. The 0-1 called strike in the outside corner. 0-2. 21 likes. Get that like button up, ladies and gentlemen. The 0-2 foul. And we'll see. We'll see, Jacob. We'll see what happens. Here's the 0-2. Foul away. Do it again. O2 incoming, fouled away. We will do that one again. Cortez, 22 pitches in this inning. Here's the O2 incoming. The pitch hitting here in the right field, and that's going to drop for a base hit. Runner rounding third, and he's going to score. Yankees down 3 nothing. Runners on the corners, one out. Here we go again, Nestor. Here we go again. Same old shit, just a different same old shit, just a different day for Nestor Cortez. Yeah, they, he might not I I'm not going to say he's not going to make it out of this inning cuz he did it last time, but there yeah. This is two bad first innings. For Nesta Cortez. Jorge Barosa is up. 
Here's the piston. and it shows Bunt. Bunt's it down the first baseline. The play at the plate, and they have him in a pickle. Servino throws it back to Cabrera, who tags him out. And Cabrera's going to throw it back to first, and he gets him out. That is a 3-1-5-3 double play. <laughs> yep, here's the bunt. Rizzo, three to Trevino, who tags out the runner at third. Throws back to uh, – ne no, actually, that was back to Nestor. So, correction, that was a three. I just want to make sure they, they – just wanted to make sure they weren't challenging it for Nestor Cortez blocking the bag. So Okay, so that was a three, two, five, one double play. That's a weird double play. You don't normally see those. But the Yankees are out of the inning in a little bit of a flashy fashion, but they trail 3 0. That's the Cortez. Another shaky first inning for him. We're heading to the uh, top of the second. Do up. Stanton, Verdugo, Volpe. Yankees still in search of that first hit. Put it down in the comment section, ladies and gentlemen. Who's getting that first Yankee hit of the game? I'm going to say Anthony. I actually, I said Soto, but it could be Anthony Volpe. Nestor's our worst pitcher. He's looking like it, Dre. He's looking like it. Got you, Jacob. Thank you, man. All right, let's see if Nesta Cortez can actually settle down like he did. But it is a little concerning for him. I did say on the weekly talk show that I do with Max a couple weeks ago, I think Nestor might be a, might be the odd man out. To everybody in the building so far early, appreciate you guys. Alec Cass says, we need these guys to stay healthy for us, even to think about it. Yeah, we do. All right, here's Stanton. Call strike, top of the zone. 0-1 count. Yeah, health is going to be key, especially for some of our some of our big guys. Now, obviously, you know what I'm saying, we're missing Cole, ball outside. But hopefully we can get Garrett Cole back for a little bit of a uh, late season push. But outside of Nessa Cortez, the pitching's kind of held up. Foul ball. One ball, two strike count. Come on, man. What are we doing? We got a game day. Jandry's in the building. What's going on, my guy? One ball, two strike count to Stanton. Locks him up. Strike at the bottom of the zone. Stanton backwards K. I got it, Tomcat. Let me call it. Here's Verdugo. First pitch to Doogie. Call strike, bottom of the zone. 0 1. The pitch, and that's fouled away. Quick 0 2 count. Gallon looking for a quick 1 2 3 inning here. See if the Yankees can make him work. Tired of being the, Yan uh, the Yankees being a mid-team, trying to go back to being the dynasty. But you know what? They're looking pretty good so far to start the season as Verdugo takes a ball in the inside corner. One ball, two strikes. It's got to start with one, Alley Cat. Got to start with one. But you know what? We have a long season ahead of us. As Verdugo stays alive, fouls that away. One ball, two strike count.
Seven likes from 30. We get to 30, now we'll gift away a membership. We just had a monthly member giveaway about, about an hour ago. Congratulations to Adrian for winning. Ball low, 2-2. Two, two. Anthony Volpe's on deck. Had himself a 4-for-4 four four game yesterday. First ever four-hit performance for him. The 2-2. Two, two. Ball inside. 3-2. Good take right there. Uh, You're right on that one. It's the most optimistic I've been in a hot minute. Yeah. And it's warranted. Your, your optimism is warranted. This team looks and feels different. We just have to stay healthy. The 3-2. Rip down the line and foul. Souvenir for somebody. Um, Yeah, we just got to stay healthy and we got to start playing well. Let me tell you this. The team has played well and Aaron Judge hasn't even really got started yet. So imagine how it's going to look like with the combination of Soto and Judge hitting. Gallon, 30th pitch incoming. The payoff pitch is hit on the ground right to the first baseman. He's going to take it to the bag himself for out number two. Jay, here we go. I got to beat you, Jay. If you're a member of the channel, drop those Volpe emojis for our guy, Anthony Volpe. <laughs> Volpe, four for four in yesterday's ball game. Robert, thank you for dropping the Volpe emoji. Appreciate that. First pitch to Anthony. Ball on the outside corner. One ball, no strikes. That's so true. Judge isn't carrying the team right now. Nah, he's not. But that's a good sign for us, though. The fact that Judge hasn't got going and we've been able to beat good quality teams. The 1-0. Ball outside, but he gets the call strike. Volpe doesn't like it. Neither do I. Here's the 1-1 to Volpe. The pitch. Hits a right field, and that's going to be a base hit. Anthony Volpe, five hits in a row. Puts him on first with two outs. Send him. The only thing that we – Volpe looks really, really good, guys. He looks really, really good. The only thing we haven't seen from Volpe is, is his stealing ability. His plate discipline looks amazing. He looks like a complete different player from uh, last year. It's early, but it looks good. Here's Cabrera. He's got off to a hot start for us as well. First pitch to him, ball high and tight. One ball, no strikes. Checks at first. He didn't go far. Back to the bag. I'll tell you what, allergies are whooping the shit out of me. Ooh, had to cut the grass today. Mother Nature, man, is getting that extra strain pollen, man. I'm telling you, this shit's ridiculous. Ball on the inside corner, 2-0 to Cabrera. All right, so what looked like it could have been a quick inning. Uh, Yankees have made him work a little bit in this inning as well. The 2-0 from Gallon. Ball, that should have been a strike. Cabrera gets the call on that one. Three balls, no strikes. But hit that like, ladies and gentlemen. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe for year-round New York Yankee play-by-play -play by yours truly, the ace. Five subs from 950. We're on the road to 1K. Here's a 3-0. He should be taken all the way, and he is for a called strike. 3-1. Three one count to the eight hole hitter Cabrera. Here's the pitch. Cabrera hits that up the middle off the shortstop who tried to make a diving attempt, and that's going to be a base hit. Two on, two out for Jose Trevino. Let's see the Yankees get some of these runs back here with two outs. Two consecutive hits with two away. Shortstop just couldn't come down with that with the diving attempt.
I really wish we could have the volume up. I would love to see what Garrett Cole is saying. It's been a while since we had a Trevino home run. Can we get one? Is he due? First pitch to Trevino called strike top of the zone. Oh, one. That was a that was a good pitch right there. Allie says bats uh bats better stay hot. I like it. Look, I just want to keep the line moving. Just keep the line moving, whether it's a walk, hit, put the ball in play. Just keep the line moving. The 0 1 count. The pitch, swing and a miss. 0 2. Trevino, quick 0 2 hole for him. This Yankee team has been manufacturing a lot of runs, not via the home run. Gallon already over 40 pitches. He is due, but keep it moving. Yeah, Jay, I just want to keep it moving. Just keep the line moving. The 0 2. Ball outside. One, two count. Here's the one, two swing and a miss. Gets him down on strikes. So Gallon, even though he struggled a little bit in the first two innings with the pitch count, at least has got through these two clean. We are heading to the bottom of the second inning. McCarthy, Perdomo and Marte coming up. Can we get a clean inning from Nestor Cortez? Yeah, 41 pitches. That I mean, if we're going to have a moral victory, that's what they're going to say. At least at least we have the pitch count high on this on this pretty good pitcher, you know what I'm saying? But you know, we got to get into the get into the bullpen. We were able to get into the bullpen really early yesterday. They used five relievers. See if we could do it again. But we are at 28 on YouTube. Thank you guys, man. You guys are the best, man. Appreciate you guys as we embark on year two of the ace avenue this is the second season doing this yankee play-by-play -play. i'm having a good time doing it channel's growing more and more every day we are at 9 45 on the road to a thousand hit that like if you're new to the channel hit that subscribe like i said i will be live on my boy grunt baseball's channel tomorrow i'll make sure to drop the link in the community tab then i'll be right back here on friday after the yankees off day for the home opener i cannot wait But also, on the Ace Avenue, we do New York Giants content on here as well. And go check out my movie playlist, where I do reviews, reactions, and rankings to all of my favorite movies and more. It's been a slow start to the movie season. It really has been. So I got to make sure um, I stay on top of that. I'm excited for Deadpool and Wolverine. That's going to be amazing. Can't wait to do a review on that one. Oh, Yankee Stadium is going to be crazy on Friday. One o'clock game two. That's just going to be that's just going to be nuts tomorrow. Uh, on Friday, I should say. It's going to be a raucous crowd out there. It's gonna, everybody's going to be hyped. I can't wait to uh, the bleacher creatures. For them to be chanting Soto's first ever uh, uh, ovation. Yeah, Allie, it's going to be electric. It is. I don't know yet, Mario. We have to see how it goes. Maybe as it gets closer. All right, we're back. Nesta Cortez, first pitch, foul. 0-1 count. McCarthy's in the box. The eight-hole hitter for the uh, Diamondbacks. Here's the 0-1. Popped up. On the infield, Volpe's there. He's in the grass, backtracking, and he'll make the catch for out number one. Allie says, as long as the Mets and, and Astros are trash, I'm happy. We're on the same page, Allie. We're on the same page with that. Six likes from 30. We get to 30, now gift away a membership, ladies and gentlemen. First pitch to Perdomo. Call strike outside corner, 0-1. Are you from New York, Allie? Are you also a Giants fan? The 0-1. Ball high, but that should have been called a strike. Doesn't get the call. 1-1. Jacob says, having a feeling May's going to fall. We'll see what happens. If May falls, Giants might take him. You never know. Ball high. 2-1.
The 2 1 call strike 2 2. The 2 2 ball high 3 2 full count. Come on, Nestor. We need a quick 1 2 3 inning from him. Three, two, foul, stays alive. Got you. Yeah, Texas, on, uh, batter calls time. Texas is on my list. I have a, a good friend that lives in uh, Rowlett. The three, two. Hit on the ground, right to Cabrera. He's there, throws the first, out number two. Two away here in the bottom of the second inning. I have no idea where that is in relation to where my friend is. I'm not even going to lie. But Texas is definitely on the list of places to visit. I hear it's, dope. I hear it's cool over there. That ball misses on the outside corner. One ball, no strikes. 944 subs, guys. Let's get to 950. Okay, that's what's up. The 1 0. Ball inside, 2 0. Jacob says, give him Cole as an announcer every game. Unfortunately, we can't really hear it. Foul ball, 2 1 count coming up. The 2-1 hit on the ground. Good sliding play by Volpe. Gets up and throws it to first on a one-hopper to end the inning. A nice, clean inning for Nestor Cortez. A good bounce-back inning after he allowed three. We are heading to the top of the third. Top of the order coming up. Torres, Soto, Judge. Coming up. Let's see if we can get some of these runs back. Aaron says, let's go D-backs. Worry about your Mets, man, who watered down the field just so that way they didn't have to get embarrassed again at home. I saw the grounds crew out there. It didn't rain that hard. The grounds crew were out there watering it down just to make sure the field was unplayable because they didn't want to get their asses beat again. We got a lot of people in connect around the Connecticut area here. Yeah, Val, he did need that one, two, three. You need a reset on the seat. You need a reset on your whole roster. That's what you guys need. To all the Met fans that think, yo, we're getting Soto next year, not with the way you're looking. And let me tell you this. I think he loves being a Yankee. Nah, we don't want him. Y'all want the former Yankees? There's a reason we got rid of them. Y'all can have them. All right, here's Glaber Torres. Glaber got us started with a walk in the first inning. Ended up uh, being part of a double play. First pitch is hitting you at a right field, right at the right fielder. Who makes the catch for out number one? One pitch, one away. Here's Juan Soto. Drop those Soto emojis. Damn it, Jay. I forgot. It's a beat, Jay. I'm going to get you, Jay. Here's Juan Soto. Who's on deck? Aaron Judge. Drop those all rise emojis right after this. I'm beating you on that one, Jay. 
First pitch called. Strike right down the middle. 0-1. Yeah, he has been, Grunt. Nestor has been so blessed. But hit that like button, ladies and gentlemen, if you haven't done so already. The 01. Wow, 02. Oh, and let me tell you this, Allie. If they if the Yankees even, the only way I can see the Mets getting Soto is if they go like a hundred million dollars over the asking price. That's the only way. All they got is money. If the Yankees even get close to it, there's no way he goes over there. Not with how we're constructed and they're constructed. I'm going to give us about a 70% chance to draft. So, uh, not draft, to re-sign Soto. <clears> 0-2 oh, count to number 22. Ball misses low. One ball, two strikes. With one swing of the bat, Soto can get the Yankees on the board. The 1-2. Here's the pitch. Locks him up. Ooh, good pitch right there. Great pitch to a good hitter for out number two. Soto down on strikes. Here's Aaron Judge. Drop those all rise emojis in the chat, ladies and gentlemen. Terry says, Soto wants to win. I can't see him leaving for the money to go to the Mets. No, they stink. Foul ball, 0-1. Aaron Judge walked in his first at bat. 143 on the year, one RBI. He's got to get going. Thank you, Terry, for dropping the all-rise. Foul ball, 0-2 count. I mean, it's Gallon, Gallon is uh, kind of mowing through us right now. About to have 50 pitches, but he's mowing through us. Let's see if we can get into that bullpen right now. Let's see if we can get into that bullpen. <laughs> Here's the 0-2-2 judge outside. One ball, two strikes. One, two count. Ball just misses high. Good take. Two, two. You rather live, rather live in the darkest layer of hell than be a Mets fan? The Mets are in hell right now. They're in purgatory. Ball low. Three, two. Full count. We got 26 people in the building. 29 total, including on Twitter. Hit that like, ladies and gentlemen. Six likes from 30. 3-2 count to the captain. Fouls that away. Stays alive. <laughs> the 3-2. Incoming. The pitch. Ball low. And he gets the strike. You got to be fucking kidding me. You got to be kidding me. That was like three feet below the below the strike zone. Holy shit. If we didn't, if the umpire wasn't terrible yesterday, that's ridiculous. That is an inexcusable for a professional umpire. Jacob, I already saw the comment, man. I got it, man. Thank you. Don't. Unbelievable. You, like, I can't believe they called that shit a strike. Yeah, I yo, that was terrible. Absolutely terrible. You can't do that to judge. You just took phew. Yankees need base runners and you just took you you possibly just took one away.
Yeah, the umpire does need glasses. Gallon needs to take off his goggles and give them to the umpire. Because that, that was fucking ridiculous. All right, do up. Alexander, Goryal, Walker. First pitch is popped up foul. Alexander, one for one. The 0-1, oh foul, 0-2 oh count. Tomorrow's day game, 340. Batter calls time. Here's the 0-2. Oh Fouls that away. Stays alive. <laughs> Who did we use in last night's pen? 0-2. Uh, oh ball high. One ball, two strikes. We used Weaver... Uh, Birdie. I think we just used Weaver and Birdie. I think maybe, uh, I'm not sure if it was Ferguson. Ball should have been a strike in the outside corner. What, what the fuck is this umpire doing? Bro, it doesn't give him that call, but you called it a foot at the bottom of the zone for judge. Ball high. And then, oh my goodness. Two two count to Nesta Cortez. Here's the pitch. Hits to the right side. Pass to diving Anthony Rizzo. Lead off single. Puts the runner on first. Nobody out. Blaze Alexander. Two hits in this ball game. All right, here's Lourdes Goreal Jr. Runner on first, nobody out. First pitch is popped up. Glaber's in the outfield. He's there. He'll make the catch out number one. I don't condone this type of shit, but if I'm Trevino, I'm going to just let one go and just hit the umpire. <laughs> Obviously, I'm kidding. I don't condone that type of shit, but... This umpire is ridiculous tonight. Christian Walker, one for one with a single uh, and a run scored. <laughs> Nesta Cortez could really use a DP right here, a double play right here. First pitch call strike in the inside corner, 0-1. Oh Terry says she does condone that behavior. Oh, Terry, you savage. Runner takes his lead off first, the 0-1. Couldn't hold up on that one. He did go around. 0-2 count. Five likes from 30, guys. If you haven't done so, hit that like and subscribe. Appreciate you guys for popping in. Game six of this New York Yankees. The 0-2. The pitch popped up. Runner was on the go. And that might fall in no man's land, as it will. Runner went back to first, and they're going to get him out at second. A hit and run, an unfortunate hit and run for the Diamondbacks. Runner was on the go. Ball hit as, as Glaber Torres was covering. Glaber tried to get it. It fell in no man's land, and Soto throws the second for out number two. Yankees catch a break right there. So two outs here. Here's Suarez, one for one. Misses inside. One ball, no strikes. Ball 
the 1 0 inside 2 0. Two zero count, ball low. Three zero. Game day is taking a while to update. Anytime there's a weird non-traditional type play, it like confuses game day. Game day is like, you could just see them stressing. Like, how are we gonna call this? The three zero ball high. Four pitch walk puts two on with two out. Come on, Nestor. Moreno's up. One for one with the RBI single in the first inning. And here goes game day now updating really quickly. Two on, two out here in the bottom of the third inning. Outside, ball. One ball, no strike count. Cortez having a hard time finding the zone here. Already over 50 pitches for Cortez. He has easily been our worst pitcher this year so far. The 1 0. Called strike outside corner, 1 1. Three likes from 30, guys. Hit that like button. The 1 1 popped up. Volpe going out for it, and he'll make an over the shoulder catch. Good catch there by the Gold Glover. Strands, two runners on. We are heading to the top of the fourth inning. Do up. Rizzo. Stanton. Verdugo. Let's see if the Yankees can get these runs on the board. Appreciate you guys for popping in here, ladies and gentlemen. If you haven't done so, hit that like. I'd like to welcome you to the Ace Avenue. I'm yours truly, the Ace. That's a hard play to make. That really is. It's a really hard play to make. Yeah, we got a hit now. You're right. We got to get a hit. Val says, that's the way to do it, Volpe. Yeah, you looked good on that one. Volpe's a, uh, a good defender. Got the gold glove last year. Some people think that he didn't deserve it. You know what I'm saying? Kind of got it by default. But I think he's he's got a lot better arm than what people have given him credit for. He's got really good range. I think he's solid. I think he's solid. Aaron says, what's the next movie I'm excited about? Uh... Uh, Deadpool and Wolverine. Actually, before that, I'm excited for the Planet of the Apes movie. I'm excited for that one. This hasn't been a good um, this hasn't been a good early season for movies, but obviously everybody's excited for Deadpool and Wolverine. I'm excited for Planet of the Apes. I love that series. Um, trying to figure out what else is coming out. That's that looks really good this year. Well, no, Planet of the Apes drops next month. I'm excited about that one. I got to do that, and I got to do a ranking on those movies. <laughs> All right, here's Rizzo. Yankees need some base runners. Ball low. One ball, no strikes. What about you, Aaron? What movie are you excited about? I know you're a big movie buff, too. We got to catch a movie together, man. I know you work during the day. I usually go see the movies during the day, but, yeah, we got to go We got to go together. Here's the 1-0. Ball low, 2-0. Terry says, I love the Planet of the Apes, too. Yeah, they're really good movies. I love those uh, those movies. Two likes from 30, guys. Hit that like. The 2-0. Popped up and out of play. Foul ball.
Gallon at 57 pitches. Two one count. Takes a strike in the outside corner. That's a good pitch right there. Couldn't have pitched that better if he walked it up there. Two two count. Come on, Riz, with Stanton on deck. Two two. Foul. Gallon at about to be at 60 pitches for the night. Shout outs to all my night owls out there as it's 1030 over here on the East Coast. Appreciate you guys for rocking with me on this late night edition to Ace Avenue. 2-2. Two, two. Rip down the line. Out of play. Foul. I'm usually up at this time anyway, but I know a lot of you guys are night owls. I know Terry is. I know Aaron is. Love these West Coast games. The 2-2 count. Hit to left field. Right at the left fielder who makes a sliding catch. Slider was a little bit extra at the end. But he makes a good a good play uh, nevertheless. Good play by Goriao Jr. Here's John Carlos Stanton. Struck out in his last at bat. Okay. Yeah, I'm excited to see that one. That that one's on that one's high on my list. The first the first two movies were good. The third one was okay. Stanton pops that up. And that ball is gonna go out of play. Foul. <laughs> Let me tell you, Stanton's gotta get this shit going already. Oh, one count. Foul. Late on a 92 mile per hour fastball right down the middle. His bat speed is cooked. <laughs> Stay away from the breaking ball. Stay in 0 2. They're going to give it to you. Here's the pitch. Breaking ball misses, bounces in the dirt, takes it all the way. 1 2. One, two pitch and coming. Swing and a miss at a slider that was like three feet off the plate. Stanton is just. He wasn't even close. He was not even close. Two outs here. Verdugo coming up. Here's Verdugo. Check swing. That's put in play. The first baseman's there. Tosses it to first for out number three. The Yankees go down one, two, three. Heading to the bottom of the fourth. See, the Yankees can get a shutdown inning. They get these bats going. Uh, Barossa, McCarthy, and Perdomo coming up. Uh, Soto helps Stanton is what Terry says. I don't even think I don't even think Soto can help Stanton, uh, Terry. His bat speed is done. Like once your bat, once your legs and your bat speed are done, it's hard to. You're just up there guessing. Yeah, I can see that, Aaron. The Mets will lose out on Soto and then pivot to trading for Stanton. I can see that. That'd be a great move for both teams. We should trade you guys, Giancarlo Stanton. <laughs> I 
I mean, we know how much the Mets love our uh, sloppy seconds, man. So it's like, you know, you guys got to, you know, get every former Yankee. See if the Yankees can make another comeback win here. This game is about an hour in, going, going rather quickly. Yesterday's game was long. Yesterday's game was a three hour. It felt like the pre pitch clock games. First pitch from Cortez in the fourth inning. Ball outside. One ball, no strikes. Yesterday's inning, yesterday's game was long because the Yankees were working the shit out of those pitch counts. 1 0. Call strike top of the zone. 1 1. One one count to Barroza. Ripped on the ground. A good diving stop by Cabrera. Gets up and throws the first for out number one. Cabrera just saved not just a hit, but extra bases on that one. That's my third baseman, Dre. There we go, Oswaldo. Val says, excellent by Oswaldo as McCarthy takes a strike. 0 1 count. One life from 30, guys. Check swing. Did he hold up? He did. Ball one. We get one more like, and I'll gift away a membership, ladies and gentlemen. One one count. Hit on the ground. Foul. The one, two. Nestor went a little sidearm action there and misses low. Two balls, two strike count. Punch this guy out, Nestor. The 2-2. Two -two. Misses low, 3-2. The 3-2 is ripped right at Juan Soto for a base hit. Runner on first, one away. <laughs> Runner on first, one away. Here's the nine-hole hitter, Perdomo. Val in New York, congratulations on the membership. We get to 50. I'll give it away another one. Here's the pitch. Hits a right field. Right past Gabriel Torres. Base hit. Back-to-back -back singles. Runner's going to go for third. Nope. Go back to the bag. Good strong throw by Soto. Two on, one out. Top of the order with two on, one out. Nessa Cortez cannot afford to give up any more runs here. Our offense is good, but you can't afford another three-spot inning. Here's Marte, one for two. Got them started with a double in his first at-bat. Here's the pitch. Hit on the ground. Could be two. Volpe's there. Underhands it to second for one. And gets him at first for the double play. 6-4-3 double play ends the inning. We are heading to the uh, top of the fifth. Exactly what we needed. Let's see if they're going to challenge. Let's see. They're on the phone right now. Let's see if it holds up. They're taking a long look at this one. 
And I believe they are going to challenge here. Umpires getting together. Let's see. The call on the field, they are reviewing it. This might have came from uh, New York, so this is why it might be a little bit quicker. Let's see. Here's the replay. Underhanded to, uh, from Volpe to Glaber. Throws from Glaber. Oh, that's bang, bang. Because they called it an out on the field, I don't know. It looked bang, bang to me. Ty goes to the runner, though. Let's see, from a different angle. Yeah, it's so close to tell. If they kept it on the field because of where it was called, because of what it was called. Yeah, I think he might, I think he might be safe. I think he might have just beat it out. So we might have runners on the corners with two away. I think he just beat it out. Yeah, I think he, and that super slow-mo, it looks like he just beat it. And they are going to call him out. They're going to keep the call on the... No, okay. They 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 said out at second, safe at first. So runners on the corners with after the force. First and third, two outs here. Game they should update in a second, guys. Blaze Alexander's up. Two for two today with two singles, a stolen base, a run scored, and an RBI. First pitch to him. Ball high. One ball, no strikes. Nice challenge there by the, uh, by the Diamondbacks. Just was safe. The 1 0. Foul. 1 1. Here's the 1 1. Foul ball. 1 2. Cortez, 90 mile per hour fastball. You can't leave a 90 mile per hour fastball right there. You have to pitch precisely on the corners. Here's the one two. The pitch, swing and a miss. Nessa Cortez is hype right now. Gets him down on strike. So it took an extra batter. But he gets the job done. Still three to nothing. Heading to the top of the fifth. Do up. Volpe, who's one for one. Put those people of Volpe in, in the chat, guys. I beat Jay. Volpe. Cabrera. Trevino. Ah, I got you, Jay. Nine fifty over here on the East Coast. Appreciate you guys. Three forty start time tomorrow. Like I said, I'll be on Grunt Baseball's channel. A lot of you have come over from, or some of you have come over from Grunt. Jay, I know Jay came over from Grunt's. Beast Baseball's come over from his as well. Um, appreciate you guys. I'll be back over there tomorrow. I'll make sure I drop the link in the comment in the uh, community tab.
probably should start setting up the stream for tomorrow. Probably do that tonight. Fix the thumbnail real quick. So that way my ass can sleep in until tomorrow. All right, first piss of Volpe, call a strike at the bottom of his own. 0 1 count. Anthony Volpe, one for one. The 0 1 check swing, but he held up. One one count and popped up foul. The one two to Volpe. Gallon seventieth pitch is jammed and foul. The pitch to Volpe locks him up. Cold strike at the top of the zone. Good pitch right there. Gallon is, is mowing us down right now. Good piece of pitching right there. Here's Cabrera, singled in his first at bat, takes a ball low. One ball, no strikes. One ball, no strike count. Yankees need some base runners here. Ball outside, 2-1. Two oh, I should say. My fault. My fault. Uh, my apologies. Two one. The two oh. Ball low. Three balls. No strike count. Come on, Cabrera. Get on base. Trevino's on deck. Followed by the top of the order. Here's the three oh. Walked him. So Cabrera's hot start continues. He's on first with one away. Come on, Jose. Four subs from 950. Ladies and gentlemen, you haven't done so, hit that subscribe. I'll be on Grunt Baseball's channel tomorrow, 340 start time. First pitch to Trevino, right down the middle, 01. Ball outside. Evens up the count at 1 1. I got to get that. I got to remind myself to get that Jackie Robinson hat before Jackie Robinson Day. It's a Yankee hat that's just like this, but with the 42 on the side. 77th pitch. Checks that first, but he's safe. Come on, guys. Make some noise in the chat, man. Clap it up for the Yankees. Let's get these bats going. The 1-1. One, one. The pitch, cold, strike outside corner, 1-2. Here's the 1-2 to Trevino. Trevino hits that on the ground, could be 2. Throws a second for one, and that's a double play. Another double play for the Yankees. Has them go down one, two, three. Bottom of the fifth inning coming up.
Bats don't look like they have it today. But we still got time. M and Y is in the building. Says, let's go. What's going on, my dude? How you doing? We're going against a really good pitcher today, guys. Gallon 090 ERA. Salute to him. Salute to him so far for shutting down this good offense. We got 12 outs to work with. See if Nesta Cortez could come back out there after settling down. His first innings. I don't I don't know what he's doing in the first inning to look like this this much shit, but you got to switch up what you're doing. Your first inning preparations need to be a lot better if uh if you've been struggling out the gate this much in the first two games, your first two outings. Neo's in the building says I miss Wells. I mean, you're talking about David Wells? That's what I'm assuming you're talking about. I'm just, just for the hell of it, I'm going to go ahead and gift a, another membership. Blue Hall, congratulations, my guy. All right, do up for the Diamondbacks. Goryal Jr., Walker, and Suarez. Calendar day, Sunday for the New York Yankees, 135 start time. Nestor back on the bump. Yankees, no runs, two hits. Diamondbacks, three runs on eight hits. First pitch to Goriot Jr. is called strike in the outside corner. No balls, one strike count. Here's the 0-1. Hits a left field. Got jammed on that one. Verdugo's there. Makes the catch. One away here off two pitches. Here's Walker. One for two so far. Nestor deals, calls strike inside corner, 0-1. Ball high, one ball, one strike count. The 1-1. Swing and a miss. Ball way outside the zone. Walker helping Nestor out on that one. Calls time. Here's the one, two. Stays alive. Fouls that. Thank you, Aaron, for gifting the membership. The one-two is hit on the ground right to Volpe. Throws across his body and gets him for out number two. Thank you, Aaron, for gifting the membership. Malcolm is the recipient of that membership. Appreciate you, my dude. Thanks, Aaron. Aaron, you also got to let me know what shirts you want, man. Look at the Ace Avenue merchandise store. You want a giveaway. You got to let me know what shirt and what size. Suarez is up. One for one with a single walk and an RBI. Nestor at 76 pitches, and that's a strike, 0-1. Here's the 0-1 outside, 1-1. The 
The pitch to Suarez is fouled away. One ball, two strike count. One strike away from Cortez getting out of this inning. Outside of that rocky first inning, he settled down, but hopefully the damage wasn't already done. The one, two. Just misses the bottom of the zone. If that was Aaron Judge, they would have called it a strike. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. That's the exact same pitch that he k Judge on. Here's the 2-2. Two -two. Paints the inside corner. Nestor Cortez says, can I help you? Suarez says, no, thank you. Just looking for out number three. The Yankees put them down in order. One, two, three. We're heading to the top of the sixth. Do up. Top of the order. Glaber, Soto, Judge. Can we get some runs? Jay, that's one call you're not going to beat me on, the just looking call, because we don't know when it's going to be a backwards K. But to be fair, the Yankees did get a call on that one. That was a ball. But it is what it is. They've called that shit on us all night. All right, can we get a rally inning by our New York Yankees? Top of the order is up. Third time through the order. Third time through the order is when a team can usually do damage on a pitcher. Let's do it, ladies and gents. Oops, didn't realize I muted my mic. My my bad. Uh, top of the order is coming up. Glaber, Soto, Judge. First pitch to Glaber, fouled away. How about let's get it? What I was saying was, before I realized the mic was muted, let's get a Glaber hit, Soto walk, Judge three-run home run, and we're right back in this ballgame. Glaber 0 for 1 with a walk in the first inning. 81st pitch from Gallon is popped up. And first baseman is in foul territory. And that's going to reach the stands. Foul ball. Quick 0-2 count to Glaber. <laughs> 21 in the house still. Appreciate you guys. Come on, Glaber. If there was going to be an inning for the Yankees to make some noise, it would be this one. The 0-2 ball misses low. Tried to get him to chase. Good take right there. Jay says, let's go. Look, if we get if we get like two in this inning, I'll feel real comfortable. The one two. Foul. Stays alive. Sorry for the sniffling, too. Like I said, allergies are... It's allergy season, ladies and gentlemen. It's kicking the shit out of me. Here's the one-two. Hit on the line. Right to the second baseman who makes the catch. Throws the first. Okay, they're going to say he was out, though. Even the second baseman didn't know if he caught that. Throws the first and threw it away, but they say he did catch it on a line. Here's Soto. Drop those Soto emojis just like my guy Jay just did. Appreciate you, Jay. Soto, 0 for 2. Grounded into a double play and a strikeout. 
Come on, Soto. Spark the rally for the Yanks. Here's the pitch to Soto. Call strike in the outside corner. Soto's just shaking his head like he he doesn't think that was a strike, but that was a strike on that one. 38 game on base streak, longest active in the MLB by Juan Soto. The pitch ball misses low. One ball, no strikes. See if the streak can continue here. Ball inside, 2 1. <laughs> Love that Soto just laughs it up with the umpires. As he almost got hit on that one, just looks back at the ump and laughs. He's just changing culture, man. For real, for real. Yankees got to bring him back. Ball outside, 3-1. Let's see, get some good to hit here. But we also know Soto's very patient. He has no problem taking a walk here. <laughs> the 3-1. Incoming. Here's the pitch to Soto. Soto rips that up the middle, and that's going to be a base hit. The on-base streak continues. Rounds first, but he's going to stay right there. For the captain, Aaron Judge. Drop those all-rise emojis, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go. Soto's on-base streak continues. Longest in MLB, 39. Come on, Cap. If there's a time for you to get your back going, it's right now. Val says, Soto, that's the way. Yes, it is. Called strike right down the middle. I don't know what Aaron Judge is looking at. 84 mile per hour slider right down the middle. And that's a pitch that you need to do some damage on. Judge is struggling. Uh, Judge is struggling to start the season off. Gallon at 90 pitches. The 0-1 hits a right field. Not deep. Heading towards the foul line. He'll make the catch for out number two. Soto goes back to first. We got to get Judge going. Here's Rizzo. This might be Gallon's last inning. He's at 91. It just depends on what Rizzo can do. But Judge's early season struggles continue. Ball outside. 1 0. This is a good effort that the Dimebacks needed from Gallon, considering how we got into the bullpen yesterday. They needed this. And this is why he's their ace. Called strike in the outside corner. 1 1. We got a lefty. Man Supply is warming up in the bullpen, so this could be Gallon's last inning. The 1-1, one, one, ball low, 2-1. If Rizzo gets on, they'll probably let him face Stanton because Stan sucks against righties, and then they'll probably go uh, Man Supply versus Verdugo and on from there. Here's the 2-1 count. Run our first two outs. Yankees down 3-0. Check swing. Did he go? They say he went 2-2. Two, two. My guy Adrian is in the building. Says you're followed by him. Um, she uh, appreciate you guys. Congratulations to my guy Adrian, the recipient of the Ace Avenue uh, monthly member giveaway. I sent you the link, my dude. Just get back to me on that. Rizzo thought he held up. He's arguing with the umpire right now. Here's the 2-2. Two -two. Ball misses low, so runners will be on. Runner, I should say, Soto, will be on the move. Let's get a gap shot here, Rizzo. Can score Soto from first. A walk will be good, too. We need some base runners. Unfortunately, John Carlos Stanton is up next, so who knows what's going to happen there. The 3-2. Rizzo swings at a ball. Softly hits it back to the pitcher. The pitcher makes a good play for out number three. Rizzo swung at ball four. 
when we need base runners. Terrible, terrible outcome by Rizzo. Good at bat overall, bad outcome, bad last pitch right there. We're heading to the bottom of the sixth inning. Still 3-0. Moreno, Barosa, McCarthy coming up. Would have liked to see a better outcome by Rizzo there. You walk, even though Stanton is struggling, he might run into one. I got your message, Adrian. Got you. Yeah, I just saw it. I just saw it drop down. I got you. I will message you with the shipping details. Appreciate that. Adrian wants to block Ace Avenue joint. Extra large. Okay. I got all your information. Jay says maybe that's it for Gallon. It could be. It could be. The hoodies are tough. To, I know, but it's not hoodie season. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, I can't wait for it to get cold again so I can go ahead and cop a hoodie. Like, we're literally, like, I literally busted out the merchandise, right? When it's about to be summertime. But I do got some nice ass joggers and, and fleece shorts up there that I'm definitely gonna cop. Oh, it's still breezy up there. <laughs> yeah, but it's about to be warming up before you know it. If anything, you still rock a hoodie in the rainy weather. Nesta Cortez back out there. First pitch, ball inside. One ball, no strikes. I'm copping myself some fleece shorts, though, for the summertime. And then some joggers for the winter. The 1-1. I mean, the 1-0. Ball outside. Two balls, no strike count. Don't know what that was about. Soda was running out to the field? Or further out? Don't know what that was about. The 2-0. Call strike in the outside corner. Here's the 2-1. Ball misses low. 3-1. The 3-1 paints the outside corner. Moreno thought that was a ball, but that was clearly a strike. Full count coming up. Yeah, that definitely caught the zone. Three, two. Walked him anyways. He misses inside. Leadoff man is on. Bottom of the sixth inning. Nobody out. And that's going to be all for Nestor Cortez as Aaron Boone is coming out. Nestor on hook for the loss. After another rocky first inning by Cortez, we have Gonzalez warming up. And Gonzalez will be the pitcher coming in when we come back. I appreciate you guys for popping in. You guys are the best. Thank you all.
Hit that like button, guys. Still four subs away from 950. We've been at the 950 range for like the 940 range for a minute. I want to let's get there. But I do appreciate you guys, man, having a great time calling year two. And the New York Yankees are off to a hot start, even though they're struggling this game. But we still got nine outs to go. Hopefully, we can get these bats going. Jay says, you're the best, Ace. Appreciate that. You know what? I'm going to switch hats real quick, see if it does the Yankees some good luck. It did the other day. We'll see if it does it again. All right, putting on that Father's Day edition of the Ace Avenue uh, of uh, the Ace Avenue, yeah, of uh, of the New York Yankees. See if it does the Yankees some difference. See if it does the difference for the Yankees. <laughs> Yankee bullpen editions this year: Ferguson and Gonzalez, the two lefties, Birdie and Cousins that was just acquired on Sunday. The the cousin is he? he I believe he's related to Kirk Cousins, isn't he? I've been seeing that around. I don't know how true that is, though. All right, Victor Gonzalez. Runner on first, nobody out. First pitch to the center fielder, Barosa. Called strike. That should have been a ball. Got the call on that one. 01. Terry says it's true. Okay. That's dope. That's dope to have two relatives. Are they brothers or are they cousins? Is it cousins, cousins, or cousins, brother? The 01. Swing and a miss. 02. Well, regardless, it's good to have two members in the family at the best, you know what I'm saying? The the pinnacle of both their sports, MLB and NFL. That's, that's incredible. Uh, Barros is tied for the shortest uh, outfielder, is what they said. Here's the 0-2. Rip down the line and foul. Last night, Barossa, yeah, with a uh, uh, ground rule double. Uh, don't tell me we're going to going against another little squirt, like a little Altuve over here. The 0-2. Ball misses low. 1-2. Checks at first. He's safe. One ball, two strike count to Jorge Barrosa. The one, two. Swing and a miss. Gets him down on strikes. One away here in the bottom of the sixth. Here's McCarthy, who's one for two. With a single in the fourth inning. The pitch. Ball inside. Almost got away from Trevino. 1-0 count. And Cousins is warming up in the bullpen. The 1-0. Call strike right down the middle. 1-1. One, one. 340 start time, ladies and gents. I will be live on Grunt Baseball channel tomorrow. Be calling the second um game in this season on Grunt's channel. Ball outside, 2-1. Could really use a double play here, Mr. Gonzalez. 
hit on the ground. Nope, instead it's going to be a base hit. Runner's going to go from first to third. So runners on the corners, two away. Nice little hit and run action right between the shortstop and the second baseman. Diamondbacks threatening here. That run belongs to Nestor Cortez. We need a DP here. First pitch to the nine hole hitter Perdomo. Perdomo takes a ball. He's one for two so far. Checks that first. They have him in a rundown. Throws the second, and they get him out as he overslides the bag. Two away. Runner stays on third. There we go. That was a much needed out right there. Terry says, nice. Yeah, we needed that one. Here's the pitch to Perdomo. Ball low. One ball. Two balls, no strikes. She said two balls, two off. The 2 0. Incoming. Hitting the air. Soto's under it. He'll make the catch. We are heading to the bottom of the seventh inning. They strand a runner on third, which is exactly what the Yankees needed. Do up. Stanton. Verdugo, Volpe, the Yankees need to get the bats going. Nine outs away from their first loss of the season. Seventh inning, ladies and gentlemen. Nine outs away. Put that, put these hats backwards to start uh start the rally. Jay says, let's go. We need it. Come on, Yankees. All right. Scott McGow. Mago? Mick McGow? Mago? Looks like I'm going to say Mago is the new pitcher. Olivier, thank you for subscribing. Thought you were a sub already. Hmm. Here's Giancarlo Stanton. First pitch, ball high. One ball, no strikes. Uh, Ace, I've been saving for a year to go to Paris. My granddaughter and I are going for the summer. Paris 2024 Olympics. Learning a little French, too. That's what's up, Terry. That should be really fun, and I hope you guys have a good time. 
Foul ball in on uh, Stanton's hands. One ball, no strike. Stanton has two strikeouts in this ball game. Val says, let's get some runs. That's right. We need them. Stanton over two with two Ks. More strikeouts than he has hits. All right, it's time to change the music, too, to, to give the Yankees some good luck. That should have been a strike, but Stanton gets a call to the ball on that one. That should have been a strike. The pitch call strike inside corner, 2-2. Two, two. The 2-2. Two, two. Swing and a miss. Stanton down on strikes for his third time. He's got to, you got to start putting him at the bottom of the order. He can't be batting in the middle. He can't be batting fifth. You got you to gotta put him at like seventh or eighth now. He's not even looking like he's putting competitive at-bats together. It's ridiculous. John Carl Stanton is an automatic out. Here's Verdugo. Ball low. One ball, no strikes. The pitch called strike. 1-1. One, one. Yeah, Stanton is a hot mess. The 1-1 one, one to Verdugo. Popped up. Left fielder's there. He'll make the catch. The bats don't have it tonight. It's not over, but, you know, the bats are struggling tonight. Here's Anthony Volpe. Drop those Viva La Volpe emojis in the chat. And I beat Jay. Ah, oh, damn it, Jay. Just beat me. Thought I had it. Thought I had it. Jay is on it. Here's the one, two. The pitch to Volpe. Ball low. One ball. No strikes. Thank you, Terry, for dropping, dropping at 11. Thank you. The 1-1. One, one. The pitch. That is a 1-1. One, one. I was looking at the wrong scoreboard. You got a 1-1 one, one count to number 11. Swing and a miss. Volpe swung in a pitch outside the zone. Looking like last year's Anthony Volpe. I got to put the hat forward. This, the lights in the eyes really be uh, fucking with your boy. Here's the one, two. The pitch paints the outside corner and gets him on a strike. Volpe doesn't agree. That, that looked like it could have been a ball. But that's his second strike out of the game after going four for four yesterday. Six outs away from loss number one for the Yankees. Very generous strike zone. Bottom of the seventh inning, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to be right back. I'm going to go use the bathroom. You guys know what time it is. Hit that like and subscribe. Be right back, ladies and gents.
All right, we are back. Yeah, this umpire has been really trash today. Here's the first pitch to Marte. Called strike. A one. The O one ball low one one. One one counts a leadoff hitter. Ball outside. The two one hit on the ground, backhanded nicely by Cabrera, and he's not able. Rizzo's not able to come away with it. That ball's thrown into the outfield. And the runner's going to go to third. So that is a huge error right there. Let's see who they're going to give it to. Rizzo usually makes those. So... So that's going to be an error on Cabrera, and Marte is at third with nobody out. Here's the pitch. Ball outside. One ball, no strikes. Blaze Alexander. Two ball, two and three on the uh, on the night so far. He's been, He's had a good game. The 1-0. Ball misses high. Two balls, no strikes. Cousins still warming up in the bullpen for the Yankees. The 2-0 is fouled away. 2-1. Rizzo has to come off the bag and block it. I mean, normally you try to scoop those because you're still trying to get the out, so... Rizzo normally shorthanded. Cabrera got it, was kind of off balance. Normally, you want to throw it on a one hopper, so, but the error is going to go on Cabrera. The 2 1 misses outside. 3 1. Three one count, swing and a miss. Diamondbacks trying to even up this series here at one one for the rubber match, possibly tomorrow. This game is not over yet, though. The three two just misses high. Gonzalez jumping up and down, wanted that call. This, I'm not saying that this umpire is against us, but realistically, he's been tight for us and very loose for them. What did I say? It's just, yeah, Boone should go off. Realistically, because you just, you just punched out Anthony Volpe on that very same pitch an inning ago. A half an inning ago, I should say. Unbelievable. Jake Cousins is about to be in here.
Nah, Boone's, de Boone's definitely not going to go off. He was just definitely coming out for a pitching change. Kirk Cousins' brother is about to come in. Yep, he's in. All right, Jake Cousins. His first appearance of the season for the Yankees. Let's see what he's got. First pitch, runners on the corner, still nobody out. First pitch is popped up on the infield. Rizzo's there. He'll make the catch for out number one. That was a huge pitching sequence right there. Huge pitch by Cousins to get that out. Now a double play gets us out of the inning. Still remaining at three, three nothing. Here's the pitch ball outside. Cousins are cousins is what Terry says. Okay. 22 people in the building still appreciate you guys. Hit that like button. Call strike paints the outside corner. 1-1. One, one. Here's the 1-1. One, one. That's ripped deep. And that's going to double the Arizona lead as Walker breaks his game open. Putting them up six to nothing. And the Yankees are six outs away from loss number one. It was bound to happen at some time, ladies and gentlemen. Couldn't expect the Yankees to go undefeated. Down six nothing. Walker breaks his game wide open. So Cousins, ERA is infinity anytime you give up a run he, anytime you give up a run without getting it out your era is infinity inf jacob says fuck my life it's only one game guys the bats didn't come alive today it's not over yet it's not over still six outs away but you know ball outside one ball no strike this umpire was was shit today the bats you know you gotta give gotta give credit diamondbacks team is a really good team uh, Gallon pitched a really good performance. He just shut down the bat today. Foul ball. <laughs> Maybe we're better off with Kirk Cousins instead of Jake Cousins. I don't know. The 1-1. One, one. Uh, Max says cut him. <laughs> ball inside. 1-2. Max, you've seen a lot of Kirk Cousins being in the division. What did you think of Jake? Max says just as bad. <laughs> the one two ball gets away from Trevino. Two balls, two strikes. Suarez, one for two. The two two. Swing and a miss. Good slider right there. Bounces back nicely after giving up the home run. One out in the bottom of seven. Not if we had to pay him like Kirk Cousins' contract. He's not getting that. Kirk Cousins is still going to be the breadwinner in that family. Trust me. Kirk Cousins is still buying dinners, bro, guys. Thompson's warming up in the bullpen. Yankees are familiar with him. Call strike 0-1. Oh, 
0-1 count called strike 0-2. Let me tell you this, guys. Chances are it's probably going to be a rubber match tomorrow. 340, I'll be on Grunt's channel. If we go in there, get a victory, and we're going back to Yankee Stadium 5-1, and we'll take that. These two swing and a miss. Retires the side. But the damage is done. They double their lead. Six runs on 10 hits for the Diamondbacks. Yankees three out. Yankees uh, six outs away from their first loss of the season. Let me tell you, we play tomorrow. Carlos Rodon, we need a big game from him. Played well in his first, uh, played well in his first appearance. Come out, comes out tomorrow, plays well. We go in the Yankee Stadium. Regardless, we're going to the Yankee Stadium with a winning record. So, and you know that crowd is going to be amazing. Our schedule was tough, man, to start. Like, still to get these four games and to get, you know, at least one so far. We can still try to win the series tomorrow. We're still good, guys. Ryan Thompson's coming in. Like I said, Yankees are very familiar with him. Seeing him a lot. <laughs> but like I said, I will be live on Grunch Channel tomorrow. Um, I'll drop the link in the community tab early. Hopefully, I get to see you guys there. To the new people that subbed, I'll drop the link. So, check. Make sure you have the community tab. Jacob says 80 and 82 in coming. Stop it, Jacob. Stop it. So we got Cabrera, Trevino, and Glaber coming up. Jacob says 159 and one. What about you're missing two games on that one, buddy? They play 162, not 160. Yeah, Cousins, they showed that replay. He just left that. Ooh, he left that right in the middle. Yes, he was, Jacob. He left that right in the middle of the play. That's why I said Yankees are very familiar with him. <laughs> Yankees won 24 games. Oh, that'd be, that'd be nice. Ball inside. One ball, no strikes to Cabrera. That almost hit him. Here's the 1-0. Called strike one one. I'm gonna say this. I said about ninety. To be honest, I said about ninety five to ninety eight. Could we get a hundred? It's possible. The one one, ball inside two one. Our second half of the seat of the schedule is a lot easier than the first. The Yankees are gonna be very battle tested heading into that second half. The 2-1. Rip foul. Oh, ooh, that hit off of Cabrera. Off the shin guard, I hope. Yeah, it looked like it might have got him off the shin guard. We need base runners, though, ladies and gentlemen. If we're Yankees are going to crawl back in this game, got to get six runs before six outs. Here's the 2-2. Two -two. That should have been strike three. Yankees get a gift on that one. <laughs> The pitch is hit to left field. Left fielder's going back. He's under it. He'll make the catch. Austin Wells is pinch hitting for Jose Trevino.
Yeah, you pretty much trying to get start, uh, trying to set up that lefty righty combination, that lefty righty matchup, I should say. The pitch from Thompson called strike. Oh, one count. Oh, one incoming ball outside. One, one. It could be Jacob. I could see that. The one one is hitting the air to left field. The left fielder's there. Two away. I I would honestly just prefer to have Wells get more of the time. He's young. I feel like uh, you know we know what we have from Trevi. Trevi Trevino's a good player. Don't get it wrong. He's he's been a good Yankee for us. You know what I'm saying? But I I rather just give the reins over to him as Glaber Torres is up. Soto on deck. First pitch hit on the ground. Glaber, uh, Yankees are trying to get out of here today. Here's the pitch. That's that was hit on the ground. That pitch was hit on the ground, and Glaber Torres is thrown out to end the inning. Yankees three outs away. <laughs> Glaber first pitch swinging at a ball, just trying to get the hell out of here early today. I guess the Yankees are trying to get off before midnight on the East Coast over here. 11.48 here, and we appreciate you guys for popping in and hanging out with me. With me. Appreciate you guys. So we're going to have Soto, Wells, Soto, Judge, and Rizzo. I'm, I'm, I think I'm starting to get a little tired. That's what it is. Soto, Judge, Rizzo. Yeah, I'm tired today. Yep. I mean, I did get a little nap, but yeah. So Austin Wells is going to stay in the game as the catcher, as expected. Probably won't. I don't know if I'm going to go back out. I don't know if I'm going to go back out to work. Might just take the night, rest of the night off. Perks Cousins, Perks Cousins, see what I did there, is coming back out. Uh, no, I kind of make my own schedule, but Tuesdays are normally a slow day, so I don't know if I'm going to go out today. I might just get up early, work before the 340 game tomorrow. All right, Kirk's cousin is back out there. Call a strike, 0-1. The 0-1. That... I've seen that get called a strike all night, except for right there. And a lot of this, a lot of times. These umpires' last couple games have been shit. The 1-1. Hit on the ground, right to Volpe. Volpe was positioned perfectly for out number one. Ball was hit right up the middle. Volpe was, was shifted right there. Here's McCarthy, two for three today. No, I don't do landscaping. I am self-employed, Jacob, self-employed. Here's a two, three. Uh, he's two for three today. Swing and a miss. McCarthy's had himself a good game. The Diamondbacks had some good game. Uh, good game today. Six runs on ten hits. Some good at bats. Yankee at bat. Yankee bats just haven't been able to get it going. Three hits for the Yankees. Hit by Soto, Volpe, and Cabrera. That's all the Yankees were able to muster up so far. Swing and a miss. O two. The 0-2 from Cousins. 
from Kirk's Cousins. Couldn't hold up on that one. Gets him down on strikes. Two quick outs here in the eighth inning. Here is Perdomo, the shortstop. Nine-hole hitter. Aaron Judge, 489 called strikes below the zone since 2017. That's crazy. That's crazy. Ball outside. One ball, no strikes. This is like one of the faces of the league that the umpires are taking the bat out of his hands. That's a called strike. 1-1. One, one. I mean, Gallon did his thing today. You, you got to tip your hat to him. You got to tip your cap to him. The Bastards didn't show up today. The 1-1. One, one. Called strike in the inside corner. 1-2. Here's the one, two ball outside two, two. It's hard to adjust when the umpires are so sporadic because you're one, once you're getting out one of the, one of you at bats, you're getting the outside, then you're getting the low, then you're getting the high. So it's like, it's hard to adjust. It really is. Two, two ripped. And that's going to be a base hit. So that keeps the inning alive. Top of the order coming up. Adrian says, we getting spanked tonight. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. It was bound to happen eventually. Gallon's a good pitcher. It was bound to happen eventually. Marte, one for four, double, reached on an error, and two runs scored. Here's the pitch. Call striking the outside corner. That should have been a ball. Hey, I'm so ready for like a couple of weeks when allergy season is all said and done. All right, Jacob, have a good one. The 0-1 ball in. That should have been a strike. The 1-1. One, one. Foul. Here's the one, two misses. Terry says, good night, Jacob. The two, two cut on and miss gets away from Wells and the runners are going to reach going to third. Oh my goodness. You go from first to third on a strikeout. So the inning stays live. Runners on the corners, two outs. Here's the pitch. Ball outside. One ball. No strikes. Two. That's This isn't Alexander DH. I didn't get to see who came in for the pinch hit. Peterson is pinch hitting. Yeah, it happens, Terry. You're bound to have these kind of games. It is what it is. Ball outside. You can't. I'm not overreacting over one game.
Nessa Cortez, if anything, to be you want to be alarmed over Nessa Cortez. He has not looked. He's he struggled. He set he settled down again, but he's got to get off to better starts. Swing and a miss, two one. Here's the 2-1. Ball outside. 3-1. 3 one count. Call strike. Good pitch right there. 3-2. Runner will be on the move from first. The three, two, that ball is in the dirt. So bases are loaded. Normally you see a team up six, nothing, just kind of just trying to get out of here as well, but they're still taking competitive at bats. Like they're down six, nothing. And here comes Matt Blake to talk to cousins, trying to settle him down. Ferguson's warming up. Be nice to get out of this inning without having to use another pitcher. Because you know how the Yankees are with the bullshit, uh, with the, uh, the bullpen budget. Gloriel Jr. Gloriel Jr. is up. The pitch, ball low. One ball, no strikes. Bases juice, two outs. Called strike, 1-1. One, one. One one. Bow. One two. One two count from Cousins. Base is juiced. The pitch. Bow. Stays alive. They are like, they're battling up there like they're down th uh, six to nothing. I'm telling you. This has been a long inning. <laughs> Batter calls time. Like, come, <laughs> come on, dude. You're in game fucking five of 162, and you're acting like this, like you're battling for the playoffs here. Calling time with fucking a one-two count. The one-two. The pitch, ball low, gets away from Wells, and that's going to score the seventh run of the game. Cousins, wild out there. All right, I've seen enough of Cousins. He sucks. Send him back. Did we keep the receipt? Here's the pitch. Hit on the line to left field, and that will finally end the inning. Heading to the top of the ninth inning. Yankees down to their last three outs. Do up. Soto, Judge, Rizzo.
All right, well, it's looking like it's going to be a rubber match tomorrow. The Yankees' first rubber match of the year. Um, 7 nothing so far. Like I said, I will be on Grunt Baseball's channel manana to call the series finale of this uh, of this series. It doesn't look like the Yankees are going to come back in this one. It would be a miraculous uh, comeback, though, if they did. Soto, Judge, Rizzo. No pressure needs at bats. Let's see if Judge can do something. He's been struggling. It ain't over till it's over, is what uh, Yogi says. It's not a sprint, it's a marathon. Guys, it's only one loss. <laughs> like... Let's not, yeah, the Yankees got out the gate hot. It, let's, it's only one loss. Like, you know, we're good, guys. We're fine. We weren't going 162-0, and 0, guys. I hate to break that to you. We weren't doing it. Here's Juan Soto. Drop those Soto emojis like Jay did a couple of sec a couple minutes ago. We're good, guys. We're fine. Here's the pitch to Soto. Should have been a called strike. Doesn't get the call. Soto finally got a, a call. Not go against him. Two guys got to step up. Stanton and Judge. Ball low. One ball, no one. Two balls, no strike, I should say. Judge has to step up. And Stanton's got to be sent down in the order. He, he can't be in the fifth hole anymore. You can't get three strikeouts from your five-hole hitter. Soto got under that one, popped it up. The right fielder's there. One away. Yankees two outs away from loss number one. Going five and one on this season. To start this season. The rubber match will be tomorrow. Like I said, I'll be on Grunt's channel uh, tomorrow. Here's Aaron Judge. Drop those all rise emojis. Thank you, Jay. Come on, Judge. Jarvis was the new pitcher, too, by the way. That ball misses inside. 1-0. Still only three hits from the Yankees. Soto, uh, Volpe, and Cabrera, the only three hits of the game. Yankees about to get shut out in their first loss. Ball outside, 2-0. Oh. It would be nice to at least get a run. It'd be nice to at least get one home run from Judge to get him going. The 2-2. Two -two. That's not going to do it. As that's hitting the air, the center fielder's under it. Two away. One out of way, ladies and gentlemen. Just want to say to you guys, I appreciate you guys, and make sure you have a good night as Rizzo's last hope for this for this game. It, trust me, it's allergies, guys. I'm not crying over one loss. Rizzo, 0 for 3. Here's the pitch. Bow. 0-1. Oh, one incoming ball. One ball, one strike. The one, one that should have been, it, it was called a strike. Okay. Good pitch. 
Rizzo doesn't like it, but it was a good pitch. Di salute to the Diamondbacks pitching today. Their, their pitching staff did really well today. That ball's fouled off. One, two count. Rizzo down to his... Rizzo and the Yankees down to their last strike. Yeah, I'm going to do like the Yankees and just take the night off tonight. See what I did there? The one, two. The Rizzo, way high. Two, two. Nine oh seven on the West Coast. Man, I got to get to the West Coast. I really do. It's nine oh seven over there. They still have the whole night ahead of them. Foul away. Two, two. I got to get to the West Coast. Especially if I want to do sports like for like four or something. I got I gotta to get to the West Coast. 1208 here, nine over there. They got the whole night ahead of themselves. The two two. Hit on the ground, and that should do it. First baseman's there, underhands it to the pitcher, and that will do it. The New York Yankees perfect season is done, ladies and gentlemen, as they lose their first game. They go to five and one. The rubber match will be tomorrow. I will be on Grunch Channel calling that game. Hopefully see you guys there. 12.08 to those that stayed up to, uh, with me uh, all the way to midnight. I appreciate you guys. Have a good night, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you to all the members. Thank you for everybody for rocking with me. Congratulations to my guy, Adrian, on the membership. I mean, on the, on the uh, winning the gift of membership. Appreciate you guys. I'm going to head out of here, ladies and gentlemen. See you guys tomorrow at 340. As always, Adrian says, have a good night. Have a good night, brother. Have a good night, Jay. Good night, Terry. As always, thank you for tuning into the Ace Avenue. I am yours truly, the Ace. Adios.